the policy is that we certainly want everyone who gets a first dose to get their second dose when you're dealing with a two dose regimen, namely Moderna and Pfizer. And as you well know, that's 21 days for Pfizer and 28 days for Moderna. What sometimes leads to the confusion among people when you say we want to get as many people to get their first dose as possible means rather than holding back on doses that would be designated for the second dose, given that we now have more and more confidence in the even flow of doses to go to locations, and as Mr. Slavitt said, that we're going to give a three-week window so that people will know the doses that they're going to get and when they're going to get them. We don't want to hold back things. In other words, if you give 50 million doses to individuals and then the next time around you get more doses, when you're at that third or fourth week, the first priority will always be to get the people who've gotten their first doses to get their second doses. And then additional doses will be given to the next group of people who will get their first doses. In this way, there are no doses that are hanging around. A dose that's available is gonna go into someone's arm. If a person is ready for their second dose, that person will be prioritized. If a person has not gotten their first dose, but you've taken care of all of the second dose people, then you go ahead with the first dose. So that's the policy that we've had, and that is working well now. The biggest stories, the moment they happen from around the globe. Subscribe to Bloomberg Quick Take now for insight in an instant.